How's it going, Dazzlers? Welcome back to Daz Games and another Daz Watches. I'm eating this rum cake. I don't know how much rum they put in it, but I've eaten half of it. Feeling a little tipsy. <laughs> Speaking of tipsy and celebrations, parties, birthdays, weddings, anniversaries. All of these things have one thing in common because they include balloons. Yes, that's right. Some, at some point in time, someone thought the best way to celebrate a special occasion was to fill up a sack full of their breath and give it to you. <laughs> Bloon has a long history of being there, floating around, kids sucking the helium out of them, and we all like balloons. Some people like balloons a little bit too much. Today we're gonna to be watching a, a compilation of videos, actually. There's a few videos on YouTube displaying how people have feelings for balloons that you and I probably wouldn't have. We get into the video, man. I gotta have some more of this cake. Gosh, it's so good. Jesus! First video we're gonna look at is a guy that is sexually attracted to balloons. Don't ask. You, you, if you've been here a while now, you know not to ask questions. Just watch. Just watch the video. In suburban Little Rock. Now what's he doing? What's he doing? Kissing it was weird. Where's he putting it? The best way to protect it is underneath the shirt. And you feel the balloon right there with you. It feels so close. Ah! <coughs> ah! <coughs> I nearly saw the rest of my fruitcake then. Why, why do we film documentaries on these people? Why do why do we film documentaries on these people? What do you always say when people like skin a child and make a lamp out of their head? Why didn't we see the signs? Hello? This man is having This man is putting balloons under his shirt and making out with them. In two years time, that's not gonna be a balloon, that's gonna be a Person. And you feel so warm and you feel so... In your heart just... You feel so... Just buy a radiator! Turn the heating on! Sit there having sex with a balloon? <laughs> just reaches out to this beautiful, beautiful balloon. I believe these balloons are my children. Then why are you making out with them? See? Now see? <laughs> I... I spot shit! That no one else does, apparently. These balloons are like my children, and yet this is what you're doing with them. I believe these balloons are my children. They are a part of who I am. What if one of them pops? I mean, balloons don't last forever, right? They have a they have a shelf life. They can only stay inflated for so long, and then they they go down. What what happens if he thinks they're his children when it pops? Can you imagine him on the call to the ambulance? <laughs> Oh my god, please help! Please, please! Alright, sir, just calm down. Tell me what happened. My son burst! What? All the air came out of him and he went <laughs> around the room! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry! And I feel that they make part of my so called family. I love to. What is that? That's an inflatable whale, isn't it? That's an inflatable whale. That's not a balloon. It's inflatables he likes. I see where this is going. He's about to free Willy. <laughs> Sleep with them in my shirt. They create this world of sleeping on clouds. How do you sleep with it under your shirt? How do you roll over? What if that shit bursts when you're asleep? That would scare the shit out of me. And you just want to feel the love emanating from these beautiful, beautiful balloons. Does he just have a bedside picture of himself? Two cell phones and a row of pictures of himself and he's caressing a whale. And no one has removed any kitchen knives from his house. I'm, I'm going, I guarantee you no one's done it. Some people will think I may be doing something else with them. Aha, we're not thinking it. We know it, all right? Not true at all. I am. A Pure in my life. I keep the balloons the same way. I, a lot of people... Right, hold on. <laughs> a lot of people will say, he's happy, he's not harming anyone. And you know, I have a policy on Daz Games where I'm like, do you, boo-boo, as long as you're not hurting anyone. You know, I've always said that. And, I, and I, I don't judge people. I don't judge people. I don't care how weird you are. I don't judge. I just leave you be. As long as you're not trying to eat my face, I don't care. But there is something there, right? I guarantee you, if you just took a look at his search history, I'm just, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. Like, like I say, man, we all say, I, how come we didn't see the signs? The man is 
caressing a, a fake whale. <laughs> I'm getting some of this cake, man. I feel lit now off this cake. It just tastes of rum. I don't even know. Alright, there's another video here, and a guy apparently he who has he actually makes love to um balloons. My name is Julius. I'm 62 years old, and I'm addicted to balloons. No shit. Either that or you're having a constant birthday party in that room. Look at the size of that balloon! Look at that! That's like a whole year of asthma in a balloon. <laughs> They're beautiful. They're soft, smooth, dumb. So a woman. So a woman. I, you know, and not only that, they talk back to you. Now Julius has filled his home with over 50,000 balloons. 50,000? Even the queen doesn't have that many on her birthday! The round ones, but my favorite is the spherical ones. Why? I mean, that is a big ass balloon. His house just looks like a messed up planetarium. I, I don't know. I guess it's like a guy that prefers blondes or brunettes, you know? It's not really the same, is it? <laughs> you can't compare that to balloons. I have uh, magenta, purple, yellow, blue, red, and clear. His lungs must be so strong that if he gave you mouth to mouth, you, your lungs would just f f they'd blow up. <laughs> so he's built up so much intolerance from <laughs> that if he blew in your mouth, you'd be dead. One of my favorite balloons is the weather balloon. That's a weather balloon. Oh shit. He got a whole weather balloon. That thing was designed to go up into the stratosphere and document weather conditions. I can't imagine it's getting much feedback on the ceiling. Very delicate uh, and soft and, and smooth. So a woman! Mm. An eight foot balloon in this room, so I, I settled for the five foot. I, I, I guarantee you this ends on that he owns a hot air balloon. I guarantee it. I guess you can say it's more to love. That's kind of sweet. That's what that's what everyone says about me. Yeah, you're not you're not fat, Daz. There's just more of you to love. You are just saying that I'm fat though. Like don't, <laughs> just, I don't I don't mind it. I like I don't mind it. If you they like, come at me with that shit, it's fine. It's the truth. I can look at the sky all day and say it's pink, but it's not. It's blue. You know, there's just more of you to love, Daz. And the reason for that is because I am the only YouTuber that eats rum cake whilst making videos. <laughs> I'm going through a lot right now. It's acceptable. But Julius's obsession with balloons goes beyond shapes and colors. Here it comes. Here it comes. This is the this is the dark shit. If it wasn't dark enough already, you're, you're about to, about to get dark. I love for balloons. It's also a sexual love. Yep. There it is. Ah, there is not enough rum in this cake after all. When I see a, a beautiful balloon, my heart starts to flutter and I get aroused. Oh. Oh God! Don't don't pull it like that, my man. I'll take a 12 inch and I'll inflate it to 11 inch. That way, it can take a lot of abuse. S excuse me. He inflates it to 12 inch. I'm having a new bathroom put in. That's why you can hear a lot of noise going on. If, if you can actually hear it, I don't know if you can. I'm having a jacuzzi put in. A jacuzzi tub. I'm gonna be floating. Follow me on Instagram to see my jacuzzi tub. So anyway, back, back on topic. He inflates them to 12 inch, then deflates them to 11 inch because they can take more abuse. What is he doing to that balloon? How would you abuse a balloon? We've got helplines and everything for like men and women who suffer in abusive relationships, but who's there for the balloons? I'm holding one, you know, hugging it. I'll kiss it. And it's like being in heaven. I mean, don't you like to hug and kiss the woman that you- Yes. Yes, I do. I do very much. But, and I get it. I get it. Everyone has their kinks, okay? But you don't really get anything out of a balloon. It doesn't do anything back. The only thing a balloon ever does for me is when I rub it on my head, I can stick it on a wall. That's the only enjoyment I've ever got out of a balloon. Don't you want to receive love back? Hmm? Uh, uh, what? How do you get creative with a balloon? Surely there's only so much you can do with a balloon. Does he give himself like balloon facials? <laughs> he just holds it and he just lets all the air out and it's like... <laughs> Luna is a nickname for people with a sexual fetish for balloons. I read that as Lona then. That Felt more accurate. I'm a non-popper. I bet you are, you filth. Since then, the sound of a balloon popping devastates Julius. And oh, God. So no one can come into his house with a leather-studded jacket then? <laughs> he even rescues balloons he believes to be in danger. 
Wait, is he going to the car lots and taking them away? That's like their advertisement, bro. You can't just go around stealing people's balloons. I'll go to car dealerships and um, do what I call a balloon rescue. Has he got a job? I'm not, I'm not being mean. Has he got a job? How does he have time to do this? Is he retired? Most people just go fishing, man. I feel, you know, like I give him a second chance at life. No, you're not giving him a second chance at life. It's taking them home and fucking them! When I go to the pound and I pick out a dog, when I take it home, I don't fuck it. <laughs> That's not giving it a second chance at life. That balloon was happy, swaying in the wind, being a balloon, and all of a sudden, a big fat man comes up and rubs it on his crutch, and that's his eternity until it bursts. I don't, I don't think that's a very good second start. The only people that know of is my family. My wife thinks it's strange, but she accepts it. Oh, he has a wife. Where does she sleep? Where's room for her? Is she in the weather balloon? Yeah, I bet she did. She probably couldn't because she is, she, he's engulfed her in latex. <laughs> He's put her inside a massive rubber glove. The fact that he feels like he has to keep it a secret. Uh, you can't keep it a secret. Your house looks like Telly Chubby Land. I wish him all the blessed. Blessed? What the f- I've had too much rum cake. I gotta- I'm gonna have to stop buying that. Guys, uh, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I wanna, uh... I just wanna say thank you. Um... For all the support. Uh, you guys have given me. Um, on, on Twitter and all my other social medias. Um, it means the world. It does mean the world. It's been, uh, it's, it's been real recently. I'm not gonna lie. Um, but we're making our movie, which is still open to donate if you guys wanna, wanna, like, donate and be a part of the film. I'm so excited about that. Um, everything that I've, uh, dreamed of doing, I'm doing, and it's, it's only up from here, and it's because of you. So, thank you. All the downs that I have in my life, you guys are there for, and you just lift me up. So I just want to say thank you uh, for the support that you've given me over the past few days. It's, uh, it means a lot. See you in the next video. Stay dazzling.